A census taker once tried to test me. I ate his liver with some fava beans and a nice Chianti. If you could play a character in a movie, what kind of horror character would you want to play? I'm the vampire. There's no question about it, right? I mean, let's tell it the way it is. I'm not going to be the guy that walks into the, into the house, sees the basement door open, it's walked down, it's pitch black, he hits a light switch, the light switch doesn't turn on. I'm not that guy that goes down into that basement. I'd much rather be the vampire. So Les, what led you into pursuing acting? Well, I've been a great uh, fan of movies. I, uh, our family is a uh, movie-going family, and uh, we would always talk about the movie after we left. We would say, best things, worst things. Was it was worth the cost, the, the cost of attendance. Um, and we would critique the movie extensively and uh, when I was an assistant coach more I would travel a lot in recruiting and I would sit next to somebody I would ask them what they did where they were going and about their family and I basically was shopping careers like I said I've had a lot of life's experiences and I think that I can be an asset on a movie set telling a story <laughs> my daughter's having great fun at my expense. He asked me for critiques like I know. He was saying bartender really funny well, last week. Uh, he was trying to say it with a country accent. Sure it sure kind of came out like bartender, uh, but yeah, like it was supposed to be country. <laughs> but he does pretty well sometimes. Sometimes they're better than others. If you'd come to me in friendship, this scum who ruined your daughter would be suffering this very day. Les, when did you land your first acting gig? Well, the, uh, when the game stands tall was uh, about a coach that had great success and you know some of the stories that surrounded that team. And I played myself. Camera Obscuro is a uh, camera that could see the future. I played a policeman. Sir, I'm going to need you to step back. Angry Men is about the challenger and, and really the, the most compelling story. It documents a what is a poor decision in a flawed process. What is the probability of primary and secondary O-ring failure? I don't understand your question. Quantify. How do you quantify a train is coming? You look down the tracks and you see a train is coming. I'm telling you to do it. Quantify your results. What do you hope to gain from this experience? Well, first of all, it's a challenge. Anytime that you, you take lines and you have to make them communicate at a very high level, that's, that's a challenge. I think I'm challenged by the preparation. I think I'm challenged by the moment, delivering the lines, you know, with emotion, with uh, insight to the situation that's going on. Who am I really speaking to? Certainly, I have a lot to, to pick up and learn, and, and I'm enjoying it. So as long as I can contribute and can be a part of some really quality projects. I like my, I like my acting. I guess you can call it career. So. <laughs> All right, sorry. We will not go quietly into the night. We will not vanish without a fight. Today, we celebrate our Independence Day. Help 
Keep Alabama beautiful by putting the brakes on litter.